Hi everyone, my name is Chelsea, and today we are going to be reading a book called Mindful Monkey, Happy Panda. I'm sitting outside so you might hear some noises in the background. This is a very good uh, practice on focusing on what is at hand as opposed to getting distracted. Mindful Monkey, Happy Panda. One late afternoon, as Monkey was walking home from a long day at school, Monkey came across Panda sitting serenely in a thicket of bamboo. You always seem so happy and peaceful, said Monkey. Yes, you could say that, said Happy Panda with a little smile. What do you do to be so happy and peaceful? I walk, I work, I read, I eat, I play, and I rest. I walk, I work, I read, I eat, I play, and I rest too, but I am not so happy, said Monkey. That seems true, said Happy Panda as he looked at Monkey. So Monkey, what do you think about when you do those things? Well, said Monkey, when I walk, I also think about doing chores. When I do chores, I also think about reading. When I read, I also think about eating. When I eat, I also think about playing. When I play, I also think about resting. When I rest, I also think about walking. Ah, said Happy Panda. Your monkey mind jumps from one thing to another, always to somewhere other than here, to something other than what you're doing right now. Well, of course it does, said Monkey. Isn't that what everyone's mind does? Well, said Happy Panda, when I walk, I'm just walking. When I work, I'm just working. When I read, I'm just reading. When I eat, I am just eating. When I play, I am just playing. And when I rest, I am just resting. True happiness, said Panda gently, comes from bringing all your attention to whatever you're doing right now. There's no need to think about what happened yesterday. Yesterday's gone, over, done. And there's no need to worry about tomorrow. Tomorrow isn't here. But today is all around us, bringing your mind back to this moment, right here, over and over and over again. It's called mindfulness. Oh, I get it, said Monkey. Mind full, like your mind is full of the present, full of right now. That's definitely how I want to be. And at that very moment, Monkey started to practice mindfulness. How about you? And that is the end of our story today. So here are some questions for you. Poor monkey has monkey mind. What is monkey mind like? Do you have a monkey mind sometimes? I know I do. What might be panda mind? How are they different? How can we practice panda mindfulness? Here's one thing that we can do. We're gonna practice our meditation now. So if you can get comfortable in your seat or lay down or wherever it is that you're comfortable, we're gonna start our meditation, all right? And this is a meditation game to discover whether you have a monkey in your mind right now. The monkey that may be 
in your mind is the busy monkey thoughts that jump around playing games and are distracting us from paying attention to our breathing. Our meditation practice is simply calming the busyness and anxiety of the monkey mind, focusing on just one thing at a time. And in this way, we feel peaceful and happy in this moment. What we're going to do is count our breaths. Sounds easy, right? It's amazing how challenging it can be to tame our busy monkey minds. For me, I know it's really, really hard when I'm trying to fall asleep. My mind is always just racing. So when we begin, we'll breathe in, silently counting the first breath in our mind. And when we breathe out, we'll count one in our minds again, because this is still the first breath. So in and out, that's one breath. You can also count your breaths on your fingers. Like that, okay? The key is that if your monkey mind wanders off and you start thinking about something else or you forget what number you're on, you have to start over with one. So let's practice this meditation game to three breaths. See if you can count three breaths and raise your hand when you're finished, all right? We'll ring our bell and just do three. Ready? And now we'll begin. That was three for me. I hope you got to three also. Let's ring our bell again. All right, this time we're gonna breathe five great big deep breaths in through our nose, out through our mouth, and we'll begin after the bell, the sound goes away, okay? Ready for five? I'm gonna count on my hands. See if you can do it too. All right, did you get to five? You did five breaths. My monkey mind was still listening to the neighbors next door. Was your monkey mind settled or were you distracted? Okay, we're gonna do one more time and this time we're gonna to count to 10. 10 great big breaths in through our nose and out through our mouth. Ready? Here we go. After the bell dies down, okay?
that is the end of our time together today. I hope that you can practice counting your breaths on your own. It'll help calm your mind down, especially if you're having trouble with that monkey mind like I do. Thanks for coming here today. Hope to see you soon. Bye.